it's impossible to draw all the things found on the land at the same size on the map. So we need to use a scale. Let's look at this example. Now there's a particular room with the length of 7 meters and with the width of 5 meters. Length is 7 meters, width is 5 meters. So if we are to draw this on a map, we can't find such a big paper or even we find a paper, it is not practical. So we have to reduce the size to fit into the paper we are using. So instead of 7 meters, we take 7 centimeters to draw the map. So the room we are drawing on the map has the length as 7 centimeters. And the width can be 5 centimeters. So, if we draw this particular room using this kind of a scale, then one centimeter of the map represents one meter of the real land. That means one centimeter represents 100 centimeters of the real land. Then the ratio can be stated as this 1 is to 100. So the scale of this map is 1 is to 100.